Packer, Kathleen Packer here with ILN with Kathleen.com and we are going to do day 20 again. <laughs> Seems that I did two in one day and um, got a little ahead of myself so we're going to do day 20 again because that's what today actually is. <music> going to do a little tutorial today on how to get your form for your opt-in page set up in GBO, where you go to get your code and how to set that up for your autoresponder. So follow me over. Okay, so I'm logged into my back office of my GBO account and you want to scroll down until you see autoresponder. You want to click on that. And up here where it says forms, first you want to come over here and you want to add a campaign. And you can make it ILN uh, And promo in there. You don't have to worry about the description. You just want to check that uh, your email settings are here. Um, if you want it to notify, I like to be notified that I have a subscriber. That always feels good coming into my uh, email. And just click add. So we forgot to put in our email field. Hold on. Notification email. If we asked it to notify us, we should give it an email. There we go. Now, we've got to come over here to our, we want to come back here to forms. And we want to now create a form, but before we do that, we want to make sure that we are on the right There we go. Got too many in there. Okay. Then you want to come over here and create form. And I'd like to give my form the same name so that it stays consistent. I don't happen to like double opt-in, so I unclick that. It's totally up to you if you want them to, to double opt-in to your page. Then when you come down here, I don't ask for the full name, so I come back up here and I just ask them for their first name and their email. And then you hit Create Form. Now what this will do is give you that's your H, this where it says HTML you just hover over that click on that and what you're going to do is copy this whole code to go into your ILN in your blog where let me take you there we may pause here for a minute while I go open that up okay we're inside of the ILN blog here and you want to come down to appearance and you're going to hover over it and click on widgets. And when you do that, to add in, you've got your, oh, I've moved it over here. I've already added mine prior to this, but you would drag, just click on that and drag that over here. You click on that and all you got to do is just drag it up here page to come up. And when that drops down, it says please put your opt-in form code. So we go back to GBO, we hover over this again, we copy all of this, copy, back over right here 
here. And we're going to paste that in. And we're going to hit save. And close. And then you can go my blogs, the dream, visit site. And what's going to appear over here and all they have to do is put their email in and they are good to go. So that's all you have to do to find your, set up your form, create your list. So once you've created this form, then you can, um, in your campaigns, you can there again, click on this little campaign and then you can start adding in your messages for your follow-up. All of these across here as to where you can put in your follow-up email messages so that everything goes on autopilot for you. Pure Leverage also you can do it from this side. Just click on your Pure Leverage. Come down here to Marketing Suite 1. Click on Autoresponder and you can do the same thing new campaign, then go over and create your form just like we did before. Just so that you know you can do it from either side if you are in both. Make it a great day. Peace and success. Kathleen Packett here.